welcome and welcome back to the channel today i am bringing you guys the much requested house slash apartment tour video i know this video has taken the longest time but you guys it wasn't my fault filming this apartment tour has not been easy okay because you guys know i have to put the house in order sort of to film it and that has not been very easy with a, a baby around and just a lot of other things i'm juggling but anyways your girl has delivered on her promise and i am back with the apartment tour video i hope you guys are going to get some inspiration on how to you know switch up your apartment to make it look good i reorganized slash decorated this apartment on a very very slim budget right if the budget was just slim <laughs> So you guys I'm also going to be putting in any necessary links for anything if you guys want to get it I highly recommend some or most of the things that I got because they work really well and they turned out they turned out great eventually in the apartment so if you guys are looking forward to redecorating your space then feel free to get inspiration from this video if you are new to my channel you are welcome to EJ Castle EJ land EJ view EJ house whatever you choose to call it you're welcome I hope that you stick around please go ahead and subscribe to the channel also turn on the post notification bells so that every time we release a video you will be notified hopefully you guys get to enjoy this video I can't wait to show you so that said let us get right into the video <laughs> okay so when you come in from the door um, at this side we just have this drawer that came with the house so we have this drawer that came with the house and it comes in quite handy I just put in Ugh, it's messy let me warn you guys <laughs> i just have a lot of stuff randomly put in nose mask um you know things that i need to get handy some baby things yeah just that and then on the top of this table is where we put our keys so i did put a cup here for our keys and then i have this pot thingy that i got from ikea it's supposed to it's supposed to make the house smell nice but it's been a while now and i'm guessing the scent is almost over but anyways i also have this mirror right here which i just put so you know you can take a glimpse at yourself before leaving the house i think it comes in really handy and over here what do we have over here this is our kitchen let's just go into the kitchen and see what it's looking like so this is what the kitchen looks like um, when you come in I do have two fridges this is one fridge and the other fridge the second fridge has my microwave on top now here we just have the stove top normal stove top we have cabinets on the top here um, inside this first cabinet I have like my blenders the cups not the machine itself and then this other part is just the what's it called the small uh, what's it called yeah you guys know what this is that thing that takes oil and smoke you know out like chimney sort of thingy and in this other cabinet I just put in some things that I don't use very often my what's it called <laughs> oh god i forgot the air name fryer. yeah air fryer <laughs> air fryer and yeah i have some sponges some you know things that i used to bake in the air fryer and just extra those big nylons and all of that hey mama my mommy is talking by the way if you guys hear any sound that's uri ej she's doing her thing over there so in this part we also have some down cabinets and inside i just have uh yeah these are like cooking things spices and all of that and this part i have other cooking things oil 
noodles etc etc by the way by this i just found this little space to put in like rice and nylon like you know that bag of nylon every house has that you just store a lot of nylon inside yeah that's what's going on there so in this third cabinet i have like my grains i have the beans wheat flour rice all those things i just packed them in there uh here is our cutlery area did i just say cutlery area i have this rack where i put my plates yeah it's, it's nothing fancy but it works so I, i'm just going with it and this is the sink as usual some cleaning um detergent you know yeah cleaning spray water thingy and that's like my chopping board over here i have my rice cooker so i have this other um cabinet that came with the house and i just packed some plates in it you know like just containers basically my foil my some cups that we're not using currently that's just what i packed in there and this is my oven that i use for baking of course i bought it myself it didn't come with the house and on top of this oven i just packed baby's food okay this is just baby's food going on here food snacks etc everything really over here i have this table that i put in myself just so i can have more space to fix things and i normally just keep fruits and eggs on the table come closer so these are eggs and this is bread and this is um uri's cutleries <laughs> Okay, we plates, cups, thingy thingy. Yeah, that's just what we have there. So this is what the kitchen looks like. I've showed you guys the individual things and this is what it looks like. I'm, I'm happy that there's still enough room for me to move around and do my things. Yes, I forgot to show you guys this other cabinet. <laughs> okay, turn around a bit. <laughs> so yeah, this cabinet is just filled with pots in no particular order at all. I'm baking things on this side. <laughs> And this other one, yeah, more pots and towels and I think just pot covers and just things like that. So I just packed them there. Yeah, that's just what we have going on here in the kitchen. So come, come on, come on. So over here, I have this frame, you know, that just has First Corinthians 13. It talks about love, how love is patient, love is kind. And of course, this house is full of love. So, duh. <laughs> and then over here, we have a lot going on. Just some awards that we've won ever since we've been here in China, both my husband and I. And some pictures, you know, pictures of my... Oh, how is this, what's this phone doing here? Pictures of myself, pictures of us together. I just put them in no particular order, okay? And then I also have some books over here, some children's books and also some books that I'm reading myself. So that's just it about this area. You guys remember this drawer I talked about when we first came in from the door? I also have like some snacks packed on this place, like cornflakes, um, oats, just things that will we used to make like a quick breakfast right and then very recently chinese snacks <laughs> that me and mr ej tried the other day in one video that we made some weeks ago so if you've not seen that video make sure you go and watch it it was fun yeah i just kept the rest of the snacks here yeah, i don't know where we're going to eat it but that's just that so we move over to the dining table as you guys can see i like my dining empty like i don't like to keep you know all the grocery thingy on top of it so i usually just try my best it's not always empty i'm not gonna lie but every time it gets full i just try to clear it so we can use it and eat on it because you know in our houses as children the dining was like a mini packing store they just pack things on it and people don't even eat on the dining so i didn't want that to happen in my house so yeah and then we move on to the number done the living room area i think it's going to be dark maybe go this side thank you so now we are at the living room area and you guys have seen some or most of all these things we have this couch first of all this very big couch that our landlady so generously blessed us with and then i bought these couch covers baby come closer so i bought these couch covers from 
Pindodo, yeah. By the way, I'm going to leave the links to anything that I bought to, you know, decorate this house in case in, in case you guys are interested. I did have some people leave comments for me like, okay, where did you get this? Where did you get that? Try to put in the link. So I'm definitely going to put in those links. So this is what we have for the couch. I got separate covers for this pillow. This pillow is originally red. As is the couch, if you guys have watched the video where I put together the whole apartment, you know that this couch was originally red and the and the, the pillows were also red. So I got blue for this. I don't know, I was gonna get grey, so they are the same, but somehow I just had to you know switch it up with a little bit of color. So that's why we have like blue, yeah, throw pillows on the couch. But yeah, that's the couch situation. We have a coffee table which is you know it works it's it's not so small and it's not so big it's just the perfect size and i love it so much and under the coffee table we have this rug this center rug that i also got from king Dodo. and it, i feel like this rug was such a good buy it was less than 40 rmb but then it, it works so fine it's it has good quality it's not very expensive so uh, i was very impressed with it so yeah we have that going on and then over here you guys have definitely seen this one in the other video we have the the frame thingy going on and yeah that just looks good i feel like it goes with the apartment with the whole blue if you guys have noticed i was going for like a gray blue gold kind of theme yeah that's definitely what i was going for in this living room and so far i feel like it's working over here we have um yeah we have our tree our plants our uh, fake is a, a fake plant by the way but it looks so real so i'm very happy with it we have here we just have a normal we just have the normal television set um yeah the television stand we have some speakers and also these old plants that we met in this house so there's not a lot going on here but i like it and i kept it really simple over here we have i have like this mirror that i just put in the center of the parlor i feel i feel like it adds a little bit of aesthetics to it so yeah that's what that is doing there so this is the balcony this is what it looks like we just have a washing machine over here i have like my gym thingy uh on this area we have like um this thing for like spreading clothes we have our laundry basket and also this carton where we put some laundry clothes then there's this shoe rack where we just keep our shoes yeah and we also have of course things for spreading clothes and we currently did laundry so that's why there are so many clothes there and this is just what the situation is in the balcony you guys do know this wall the balcony wall goes off so it, there isn't much of a view but yeah that's just it so for the bedroom this is the first bedroom and this room yeah this room is just this room just has Uri's bed it has a bed as well this is just like the extra room in this house it has Oriri's drawer over there where I put her clothes and it also has like my dresser yeah where I pack my things I also have like my dresser table my makeup this is where I get ready basically and it has like this wardrobe I'm sure you guys have seen the apartment tour video so you all you already you might be familiar with these things but yeah this is the wardrobe that's basically it about this room nothing too fancy but you guys have seen most of these things i also put this rug here for like just you know fancy sake <laughs> uh so now we go to the next room this is the second room of the house and in this room <laughs> this room is basically a storage room I just have this couch. I have this couch from our former house and I didn't know where to put it so I just put it here hoping to turn this place into a mini studio. I just have things packed all over. Um, baby's toys, some yeah rubbers that I'm not currently using. We have box of clothes like winter clothes and all of that. I have my YouTube gears. This is, this is where I pack like my YouTube stuff, my ring line, my camera stand and all of that. This room is basically a packing room. This is like a, a carton full of Uri's toys that she has outgrown. So I just pack them here waiting for when I'll maybe resell it or give it away or something. And yeah, this is the 
the high chair for eating that I just recently got for her. I just packed that in here and yeah that's just what this room is basically it's it's a packing parking space honestly i don't even know if i'm going to be able to convert this space into like a sleeping area if someone comes around and we have to use it because the way i pack things here it's like <laughs> even on the bed there are stuff but yeah that's just what's going on in this room now let's move over to the master's bedroom so this is the Oh, the last room of the house that we converted into the masters and this is what it looks like so we have the bed the very very wide 1.8 meter bed <laughs> we have this frame as well it's not a frame you guys it's actually a sticker that I bought and somehow I don't know why it's crumpling but <laughs> anyways we also have like the baby's bed because the baby's bed couldn't fit into this space we had to just improvise and use like the side jaws to put in this yeah this smaller um baby bed thingy for the baby i also have like a mirror in this room for you know just checking out myself <laughs> So I also have like this rug beside the bed, just at the foot of the bed. And yeah, this is just what is going on around the bed. Honestly, you guys, this room is not very big. As you guys already know, there's just like very little space left after you see the bed. So we didn't put a lot of things in this room. We had to make it very comfortable for all. So this is just what we have here this is like um the reading table in the computer this is these are just his stuff okay there's also a drawer here where we can put stuff this chair is from the dining by the way we just put it here for you know reading purposes then we have the wardrobe this house are like sliding doors wardrobe so this side is actually for mr ej while this other part is for me but the other wardrobe in that other room is also for me so yeah so that's just it about the master's bedroom there's not a lot going on this i feel like this wall sticker is really cute i'm also going to put like um the link for it they have different designs but i just chose this one that has like this couple walking together and facing the sunset yeah it's the romantics for me <laughs> And then when you come out of the master's bedroom, between the master's bedroom and this smallest room is the bathroom. So we're just going into the bathroom now. And this is what the bathroom looks like. I'm sure you guys have seen it before, but then I just switched it up with this black curtain, which looks very good. I feel like it goes with the nude colored tab. Let me turn on the light. This bathroom has like some really cute lights. Oh no, not this one. Yeah. This is bathroom. This is the this is the bath area. The shower. Yeah, there's just not a lot going on. Then there's this place for like putting your soap. And I feel like it comes in very handy because I didn't have to buy those things that you put in the wall to hang your soap and all of that. So that's just what's going on in the bathroom. This is the toilet area. It's just before the bathroom. And I do have this thing that I bought to put tissue inside. And then this thing that's supposed to make the bathroom smell nice, even though it doesn't really work. You guys, if you if you have any links of scented you know this kind of thing that actually works please please recommend to me this is my bean that you guys saw in previous videos yeah and this is yours truly <laughs> in front of the washing basin over here i just have a few beauty products like things for washing my face wipes I just bought this soap today because the one we're using is almost finished. But anyways, we also have like hand washing soap. So in case you use the restroom and you want to wash your hand. We also have like this really huge mirror in the bathroom that I love, love, love. Even though I'm finding out that this window has like dot, dot, dot. But I cleaned it today. So I don't know why these dots are still here. 
I think there is a way they say you can get rid of these things. I'm just going to have to find a video for that on YouTube. But either ways, over here we have our toothbrushes and this towel for like wiping your hands when you use the restroom. And that's just what's going on here, honestly. That's just what's going on here in the bathroom. Under this place, I just have extra bathroom supplies like um, what's it called? Tissue paper and the chair for bathing the baby and yeah just extra bathroom supplies basically and underneath it i have my baby's bath so it just comes in handy we pull it out when we need to give her a bath and after we're done we just put it under here i feel like it was so perfect like <laughs> the arrangement is so perfect because i don't know where else i would have put it and it wouldn't be in the way so that's just it about the bathroom yep i'm just going to turn off this light that is it basically you guys it's not a lot i did not do a lot to the house like i said this was supposed to be a makeover on a budget so that's why i did not you know just go um go overboard with buying things and just buying a lot of things this is just what i showed you guys is basically what the apartment looks like i am not adding any extra things to it i'm not adding anything basically this is how this apartment is going to look for for a little while to come okay so i hope you guys enjoyed watching if you did please smash the like button and subscribe to my channel if you are not yet subscribed also share this video so people can you know get inspiration to also redecorate their space you know how somehow a nice environment just makes you feel good makes you feel productive and just makes you want to do more and achieve more yes i know i know i know you know what i'm talking about and you don't want to feel that alone because we're not selfish on this channel we're not selfish people we are sharing positive vibes with people with our friends with our family so make sure you share this video you guys share to your community to your friends to your family just share to anybody that you want to show love to okay i promise you they are going to thank you for it so that said thank you guys so much for watching once again i hope to see you in our next video bye guys by the way you guys your girl is rocking pre-pregnancy hey pre-pregnancy dress say what say what <laughs> it's not pre-pregnancy pre-pregnancy dress say what say who say what